Hi everyone, welcome to Eagle All Access Women's Gymnastics Edition. I'm here with EMU head coach Steve Wilson. Coach, your start this season Sunday at Western Michigan, January 20th at 1 o'clock. Finally, after all the preparation in 2012, starting the new year in 2013, your team ready to go to start this season. Talk a little bit about them. Well, I think we're real ready to go. We're real excited. They're tired of just practicing. We're ready to get it started. So. It, and you, we can't wait for Sunday. Yeah, it's great. And you have four seniors on this year's team, so kind of a young team with 21 athletes, also four incoming freshmen. Well, it, it is a young team, and it's a young team that's been growing up. Last year we saw some big improvement, um, and those kids that were freshmen last year becoming sophomores, and, and that's when we see their biggest growth. So, you know, we're, we're looking forward to this year taking another big step in the right direction. And more on that, uh, this is your first meet of the year, so what are your expectations out of this year's team? Well, last year we talked a lot to the kids about 9-7 uh, as kind of the mark of competitiveness. And we talked about increasing the number of 9-7s we had. And last year we tripled what we did the year before. So this year we're, we've talked a lot about trying to double what we did in the first meet last year. If we can do that, then I think we're going to be right there and be fairly successful. And you do face Western Michigan to start the season. So not only do you go to Western Michigan to start a road match, but you also start in conference. So talk a little bit about what it means to start in conference and get into the MAC slate right away. Well, MAC play is important because it, you know, it does lend to a regular season conference championship. And Western Michigan is a very good team. You know, they were one of the teams picked to be one of the leaders. They started last weekend with a big win over Michigan State. Um, you know, so from that respect, we've, we've got, you know, a lot to do. But, you know, what we really want to concern ourselves with is us and taking those steps that we need to take that we can be very competitive at the end of the year. And, you know, if we can, you know, get 14, 15, 9, sevens, we're going to be right in this ball game, and that's what, that's what we're looking for out of the kids. Well, we want to begin the season with um, at least a 193 and a half, and we really want to average every meet with at least a 9.7 or higher. We want everybody to feel as comfortable, strong, confident as possible, and really have a lot of team unity. And as for yourself, you know, you've probably practiced this routine for a while, so what are your individual goals heading into Sunday and then also for the season? Um, as for myself, I want to contribute on um, floor, bars, and beam. I want an average of at least a 9.7 or higher, just like the team goal. And I really want to be the best possible captain I can for the team. And more on that, talking about the captains, we mentioned that, and you just mentioned it. What kind of leadership styles do you use to talk to these girls, not only the other seniors you have on the team, but also the incoming freshmen as well? Um, we try to do a lot of team bonding. We hang out a lot after practice and on the weekend. And we really try to ask the, ask the girls like for their feedback, feedback and their opinions. Um, and then myself and the other captain, Camille Caccini, will try and give the team exactly what they want and really try to make everybody as confident as possible. When we talked to Brittany earlier. She's one of the other captains of the team. And what are your leadership styles as a captain? How do you talk to these ladies? Um, I think we kind of, we, don't, we both have a little different style. She kind of is more like a rule setter and I'm kind of more like on the talking edge of, you know, supportive and all that kind of stuff. Um, but both of us, we really try to get feedback from the team. We try to have them come to us with ideas that they want to do at competitions, ideas of team bonding, things that we can do, and then we kind of just facilitate them more. Okay. And talking about what are some individual goals that you have for this upcoming season? Um, I want to go out and hit every routine that I do this year on bars. Um, I want to get a consistent 9-7, and I really would hope to make a 9-8 this year. Paulina, you were a freshman last year, so talk about, is it different this year coming in as a sophomore now that you had a year under your belt? It is different coming in as a sophomore. You know what the coaches are expecting of you. And the competition here at college is a lot different than it is in club gymnastics. So having that experience competing last year is also going to help this year a lot. And what are your individual goals coming into this season? Um, I would like to try an average 9-7 on each event. I think that's the scores that we're pushing for, pushing for those higher 9-8s. Um, so that's going to be exciting to see if we can do that. And finally, after all this months of preparation, working on your routines, how excited are you to start this Sunday at Western Michigan? I'm very excited to kind of show everyone how hard our team has been working and show them what we can do. 